Hi, so here we have a series of videos where we are going to solve problems based on trigonometry where we have to prove the left hand side is equal to right hand side. So we start from the left hand side, apply a few formulas, trigonometric formulas and algebraic formulas and then we reach to the right hand side, right? So here we have our first problem where we have to prove cos to the power 4a minus sine to the power 4a plus 1 is equal to 2 times cos square a. So the formulas which we are going to use over here are sine square a plus cos square a is equal to 1 and a square minus b square is equal to a plus b multiplied by a minus b. So first let's note down left hand side. We'll always start from the left hand side and try to reach the expression in the right hand side. So the left hand side is cos to the power 4a minus sine to the power 4a plus 1. This is our left hand side and if you see properly cos to the power 4a minus sine to the power 4a can be written as cos square a whole square cos to the power 4a can be written as cos square a whole square minus sine to the power 4a can be written as sine square a whole square and this plus 1 I'll note as it is. And now if we see this is actually in the form of a square minus b square. So this can be written as cos square a plus sine square a multiplied by cos square a minus sine square a because a square minus b square is equal to a plus b multiplied by a minus b and this plus 1 for the time being I'll write it as it is. Cos square a plus sine square a is equal to 1 from this formula. So this will become 1 and 1 multiplied by cos square a minus sine square a will give you cos square a minus sine square a itself. And in place of this plus 1, I can substitute sine square a plus cos square a, right? So this will be plus in place of this one, I am substituting sine square a plus cos square a, right? The sine square a negative and the sine square a positive will get cancelled and we will get cos square a plus cos square a and that is equal to 2 cos square a and what it is? it is actually the right hand side of this expression. So we have started from the left hand side of the equation and we have reached to the right hand side of the equation. This is right hand side, right? And after this we are going to solve lots of more problems where we have to prove the left hand side is equal to right hand side. So keep watching MathMart and bye bye till then.